theory of demand we have done theory of supply we have done now equilibrium <laughs> topic question study material this one should take care right so please next page preferably or next para what do i want can write like this one equilibrium concept i repeat those often we join just randomly here i am making synopsis format of notes we have made study material we we'll give this we have made exhaustive question bank we'll give this step 1 derivation of equilibrium step 1 derivation of equilibrium very interesting demand we have done supply we have done right so now we to amalgamate equilibrium which is the demand function is what qdx is a function of dx how do they relate inverse the net supply function is what psx how do they relate directly they relate so one is negatively slope another is positively slope amalgamating this what do we get we get equilibrium px qsx Check my dear students. Demand curve down Y. <laughs> I have chosen this system. You are understood, right? So there was symmetry will be there. Demand, supply, equilibrium, systematic level. The demand curve is downward slope. Supply curve is upward slope. equilibrium point both are equal now careful this is a concept which you may not know <coughs> why this point is called equilibrium even if deviations take place automatic market forces bring the situation back its original point so deviation mane what if it in changes from here to here check my dear which one is more supply is greater than demand it is called excess supply the product which was selling has got excess supply what do you do you just slash down the price right before year ending you can see all traders give sell 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 <laughs> what does it mean they will love you no one will love you except your parents unconditionally <laughs> they want to dispose of their material they want to dispose of their material they have to slash down the price and this mechanism will continue till which point till this point decrease 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 like this on the contrary the price is here so it is called excess of demand you got the opportunity to increase the price this is called smithian invisible hand why i said this so that you can understand on synopsis form but i am writing correct stability 
for the stability condition if demand is greater than supply this called excess demand upward pressure on price if supply is greater than demand excess supply downward pressure on price correct this is number a and number b and at equilibrium what is happening if demand is equal to supply what does it mean neutral pressure on price correct now what is important i made it in this way so at equilibrium what should i write excess demand is equal to excess supply is equal to zero i'm expecting this question so in one line demand equal to supply is nothing but equilibrium diagrammatic symbolic of tabular my dear make table with me carefully yeah? first combination second price third demand fourth supply make with me Though it is there is a material I am making, I am writing again. Why? So that inspired by you, inspired by this, you can you also write status. Pressure on price. Correct? I am taking five combinations. Okay. Price say forty, thirty-five, thirty-two, twenty, twenty-one. Demand say price decreases, demand increases. Okay. Price decrease, supply decrease. Arbitrary. Careful now. Combination A shows what? Which one is more? Supply is more. So may I write? It is nothing but excess supply. May I write a downward pressure on price? Again. Same here also. Combination D now. May I write excess demand, upward pressure on price, same. What about combination C? ED is equal to S is equal to zero. Neutral pressure on price. Are you getting my dear students? So this is nothing but equilibrium. Understood or not? Right? Systematically synopsis format of notes I am giving you. <laughs> Though we have made study material everything. So that you need to practice the way I am making. 
is check if they give any diagrammatic question ready any symbolic question we are ready any incomplete table we are ready lastly mathematical question <sighs> mathematical means you know numerical is very easy sir example 1 <clears throat> consider please write with me demand function qt is equal to 100 minus 3p supply function qs is equal to 2p minus 20 find out equilibrium price and quantity first you write down this question with me written first thing it comes in your mind why sir has given supply function like this <laughs> apparently when you see you may understand it is negative my dear before price it is positive. Intentionally I have given this question. It is pure supply girl. Had it been minus 2p, you would have said no. But it is plus 2p, correct, brother? Chalo, answer how? At equilibrium, what do you get? QD is equal to QS. In straight line, you have done when two lines are intersecting, they are equal. So, 100 minus 3p, 2p minus 20. Shall we find out value of p? How to find out? 5p is equal to 120. So, p is equal to 120 by 5. How much check? 24. Put this value anywhere. Qt is equal to 100 minus 3p is equal to what? 100 minus 3 into 24 much 28 correct so price and quantity we found out right carefully follow that carefully follow by that time I will make another question first you follow this do not understand again pause and take care I am making the next question for you Once more, those who don't know mass curve that way, nothing but I equated this and find out the respective value, price and quantity. What I suggest, second sum, you do on your own. Come on. First you do, then you look at the answer. Same thing. Same way, same thing. 1, 3, 5, 0, 0, minus how much it is given? I will get P is equal to 3000 plus 200 P. So, I'll calculate and find out the value. P comes as 15, I believe. If you put quantity comes as 6000. You just check that. Correct? Achha. Example 3. Consider demand function QDX equal to 100 minus 3P. Supply function QS is equal to 2P minus 20. <coughs> Find out. The amount of surplus or deficit when 
price of x is equal to say 2 by price of x if I make 20 correct different type of sum Ach, first write down the question after writing question you can start answering with me answer demand function q dx 100 minus 3 into 20 Mutlab, how much? 40 qsx 2 into 20 minus 20 Mutlab, 20 so which one is more? qdx greater than qsx so, sir, we know X is demand. I know you know that. You understood that. Another English you should know for economic term is nothing but X is demand, nothing but deficit. <coughs> Are you getting my point? Different terminology you should keep on answering and you keep on learning that. <laughs> Those are serious quick wrap up. <coughs> Diagrammatic equilibrium. Symbolic equilibrium. Incomplete table, you can understand. Pure mathematical. For from all RTP, I made it in that way. Study material we are given in descriptive way. First you go through this, then you go to study material. I'll just show you where study material you have taken care. Look, this is equilibrium. Table. They are in synopsis format. I made it in a more perfect way. Correct. Mathematical and all. I clubbed it in your. That is why I'm putting it this effort. So that when you write. You will get more things to take care in one format. After that you go to study it. Now, step 2. Very important for each term. 